Here, we need to solve for x, and we've got x's on both sides of the equation, and we've also got some distribution to do here. So we should do that distribution first. So I'm going to take this negative 3 and multiply it through the parentheses. So over here, negative 3 times x is negative 3x, and negative 3 times 2 is minus 6. And then I've got my 5x plus 4. Now, I've got x terms on both sides of the equation. I need to get rid of one of them so that x is on one side. I'm going to get rid of this negative 3x because I don't like negative numbers. Uh, I'm going to do that by adding 3x to both sides of the equation. So over here, 5x plus 3x is 8x. And over here, these two add up to 0, so this is just negative 6. So I can go forward getting the x term alone by getting rid of this 4. I'm going to subtract 4 from both sides. So I get 8x equals negative 10. And then my last step, I'll divide both sides by 8. I get to x alone, and we get x equals negative 10 eighths. Uh, I can divide both of those top and bottom by 2, so I get x equals negative 5 fourths.